Hey, how's it going, everybody? Sarasota Tim. Sick Tim. Oh, my gosh. I'm sick. I got it. Oh, my gosh. Oh. I was out on the golf course. I thought I was going to have to call the doctors. Folks, I can't stop sneezing. I'm stuffed up. I got pressure sinuses. Uh, my body aches now. I want to, want to lay down. I drove all day yesterday. I've been in this heat, playing a lot of golf. Drove yesterday. Let me make some more excuses. Went golfing today, about died. Did really good first few holes, and I went right down. Um, played with a real nice guy, Mr. Jeremy. He could really crush it. And um, I played nine holes, and then I was done. And my head, the pressure of my head, I can't stop sneezing. Water's running out of my head like crazy. I go to the pharmacist. He says Zyrtec, and just get the uh, Walmart brand. And I got some Tylenol, I dropped two Tylenol, 500 milligrams each. Probably should have took one, right? That Zyrtec says take one or 10 milligrams daily. I bought a whole box of them for one pill Went to bed at midnight last night, setting up the camp, watching TV, sitting there, and uh, got up at three o'clock in the morning, stuff on my mind, sat there. Then I was uh, trying to make a video. I met a couple of subscribers, and I went to Walmart, and I made a video. <clears throat> I'll try to get them up, and then it's, you know, I stayed sleeping in my chair for um, ever. Now I got body aches and pains. I just feel like it's ex exhausted. 65 years old, man. Going down. So I'm just going to go home, try to go to bed, turn the air conditioning on, take a shower, and crush that pillow uh, go ahead and pray <laughs> believe me uh, I could use it and uh, I'm really I remember when I was sick what, a couple of weeks ago three weeks ago whatever it was and it's it I don't know if it's coming to 6,000 foot from sea level you know um, in Laughlin and now I'm up here, and today there's all these white things that are flying in the air. Um, they look like snow. Uh, everybody kept telling me they're from cottonwoods. They're like little fuzzy white things. I mean, by the millions. And I, you know, couldn't swing my golf club. I, I played, I got a couple of pars, a couple of bogeys, and then went downhill from there. Battery died on the phone. I was trying to uh, video Jeremy. He said I could video him and be on the uh, YouTube. He's a really good golfer. And uh, I want, I'll, I'll put it up, at least him. He could really crush it. He struggled on the putting green a little bit. Uh, he, he, he sank a lot of them, missed a few. The greens are fast. Uh, but he plays there routinely, and uh, he can really hit it far. But I'm just going to go back and lay down, man. I made some videos this morning when I had a little more step in my, a little more step in my step. I got nothing now. I was going to try and play 18. I told Jeremy, I said, I can't do it. The golf course we played at, they don't take tee time. So you show up and you just hit the tee box. And you just got to jump in line behind people. That's the way they do it there. We got through nine holes. We started on the back nine and uh, started on the hole number 10, you know. And we came off of 18 
we were going to play one through nine next, and there were there were six people waiting to tee off. And I, you know, I understand. I got patience. I'll wait. That's just the way it is. But I don't feel like waiting. I feel like getting into bed. So, oh, and I did get. Um, I got the store brand, and a pharmacist told me to get that. But I did get two cans of chicken noodle. So, see, my disadvantage plan would not do anything for me right now. See, water's just pouring out of my head. Because I have a virus. I do not have a bacteria. Water just pouring out of my nose. And... All you can do is rest, drink fluids, drink, eat some soup, get some rest. My head feels like, ah, and I don't ever get sick. I'm wondering, people that say they got the COVID shot, I got all of them. You know, to go on cruises, you had to get them all. I got one, two, three, four, booster A, B, C. I got them all because you couldn't get on the cruise ship unless you had COVID shots. I had my paperwork, my passport. I mean, my my uh, my COVID shot passport. You know, you got to have your. They give you a little card showing you got it. I didn't want to get it, and I wouldn't have got it if it wasn't been for just wanting to go on a cruise. And I've never felt anything from it. Well, I lied. I lied. The booster I got. Uh, that's why Miss T won't get the. <laughs> That's why she won't get it. It knocked me down. It was just 24 hours. They can do that. A lot of people said that. It knocked me down. I was in a fetal position. Woo. I was, it was a booster. Uh, but I was all right like the next day or whatever. A friend of mine, I think, uh, Fred, happened to him too. But some people say that, you know, <clears throat> you shouldn't have got it because it takes 15 years for the FDA to approve drugs. And they approve these things in a few months. Go ahead, go ahead, you'll get it. And then, um, uh, you know, people say that it affects your autoimmune. That some people that got them, you know, I, I never got sick from it, I never had a problem. But I got sick a month ago, a few weeks ago, remember? And now I'm sick again. And I don't know if it's allergies or whatever. It's, it's totally right in here. It really is. And I feel like I'm on antihistamine because I feel very lethargic because I didn't get any sleep last night. I need rest. I, I, problem is in here, I'm young. And I'm driving, I'm playing in the heat. I'm, I'm taking long drives. Um, I'm doing all this videoing and whatever. It all takes a toll. It all takes a toll. And, uh, you know, I'm a big baby. When I get sick, I like Miss T to be here right now and put a cold compress on my head. Give me some orange juice. <laughs> uh,. That makes you feel better, man. You get a little nursing done to you, you know. They bring you some soup. Oh, yeah. I'd love that. Yeah, I got to help myself. That's why, you know, she gets on to me. She says, you got to wash your hands more. You got to use hand sanitizer. Um, you know, you're going into these places, these casinos, and around all these people. It's true. This guy here in the FedEx wants to uh, change lanes because there's a car back there, but he's got to speed up if he wants to. All right, I'll, I'll get up here a little bit. He don't want to gas it. All right, buddy. Come on in there behind me. Now, I was making a video this morning. I haven't uploaded it yet talking about crush it, you know, while you're young. and You know, you you got your health because nobody's promised tomorrow. 
I have so many people that I meet that have had relatives or themselves, um, you know, people I won't mention my name, but you know them. They got issues with their heart. They're, you know, they've had an issue. They're trying to maintain, you know, and do stuff. Things start breaking down like a high mileage car. So, hopefully this will be in uh, tomorrow. You know, I'll be brand new, right? Tomorrow morning I wake up brand new. It could happen. She was pretty out here. The only thing I'm missing is that sweet little thing to help me out. She'd help me out. She called me, told me what to do. She didn't think I should be taking this stuff. I don't know what she said. She was texting. She's got her own plan, her own ideas. Oh, man. I want to play golf so bad. They gave me a bucket of balls over there. I hit some balls. I was doing good. I was hitting slow. You got to hit slow. And, you know, then I felt weak, sneezing. Then I felt like I had to swing it. So I, I, um, I moved the RV over. And I want to just say this. Yes, it should, it should be moved over. I did it. I did it. But I want to say this. There's so many empty spaces that somebody's not going to want to just roll in next to me. They're going to say, space me out one. That's what they do anyway. They don't put you right next to somebody. But I moved it. That was work too, man. Oh yeah, that's a lot of work. Gotta bring everything in. Those slides are nice, you got a lot of room in there. But you gotta move everything out of the way to bring the slides in. And disconnect all the water, electric, sewer hoses, Raise up the floor jacks, back up the truck, put it on the hitch, drop it down, spin around, rest area. I need to pull in here, rest area. Oh, God. This is the most enthusiastic video I've ever made in my life. I barely contain myself. Well, home base is just up here. Everything's far, though. If I want to go to that St. George, wow, that's going to be a drive. The guy I talked to, the guy I played golf with today, he was talking about this crazy good deal and beautiful golf course, but it's only three hours away, he said, and you can play all day for so much money. Three hours he was willing to drive. He has driven to go, um, you know, oh, I forgot to get gas. Well, I got enough to get back into town tomorrow and I'll get it then. I can't remember anything. There's my, uh, this is my exit. It says New Harmony. And Canaraville. This is me. Oh, okay. <sighs> Let's end it. What do you say? You guys are hanging yourself. I wouldn't wish this on anybody. I need another booster shot. Water just running out of my head.
gorgeous through here, gorgeous. We'll get some video for you tomorrow. You know I'm not posting this. Crush it.